Not all Liverpudlians got to Wembley, but the whole town turned out to welcome the cup winners home to Liverpool. There's simply no way nowadays of keeping this huge Merseyside city out of the headlines. This is the first time the team bearing Liverpool's own name has won the most coveted trophy in sport, and the population wasn't allowing anybody to forget. Out of Lime Street Station came Ron Yates and his jubilant teammates. The skipper carried the cup. They went up for the cup. Liverpool never had any doubt that they'd bring it back. Heaven knows how many thousands cheered their heroes along the route to the town hall. You could sense the sheer vitality of these Liverpudlians as they massed in uncountable numbers to show their unbounded enthusiasm. If they broke the bank in the process, nobody would care a rap. Ron Yates held the trophy on the town hall balcony. Everybody had had a good view already, but they couldn't see too much of it. The police had their hands more than full. Minor casualties were inevitable in that tremendous crush. Most of them were cases of fainting. More than 600 people had to receive treatment. What's the league championship? What's an international medal compared with this? There's only one FA Cup. Until this time next year, it belongs to Liverpool.